hi welcome back to rebecca's travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to rebecca's lifestyle um here in the midlands uk in the afternoon um it's been it feels like it's red hot um, out in the uh, sun and uh yes quite humid but in the morning it was uh, just uh, chucking it down a rain so I, I can't believe it. Uh, so I've decided to do a vlog outside again um, in um, the back garden. So I'm going to jump right into it. And today I'm going to be uh, doing about um, a vlog on Great Yarmouth Pleasure Beach rides or great uh, yarmouth theme park uh, just say a, a bit well that's what it, it's a bit like um but yes not much waiting queuing up um uh, not really you just need to be there like 15 minutes before round um and again not much waiting around for rides either um, but they only allow a certain num num a number in the park, which, to be fair, I think is better. Um, and I, I basically spent the whole afternoon there. And um, I had um, some uh, fantastic crepes. Um, and to drink which um, I really enjoyed I did want some fish and chips but um, I couldn't get any in the end but um, I did have some uh, nice crepes um, now uh, let's get into the rides uh, that I've been on um, the 4D cinema uh, 3D imaginary and lots of special effects of lightning at uh, moving seats smells and bubbles um the time carousel ride um is um a a great fi uh, film and a great family uh, ride um again i think it appeals to all age groups um and really enjoyed the film and and the ride itself lots of special effects um Moving on to the disco uh, ride, um, it's I really enjoyed this fantastic thrill swinging ride. Um, it's the same ride as at uh, Blackpool Pleasure Beach, um, but really enjoyed both of the disco rides. The one at Great Yarmouth and Blackpool at Pleasure Beach. Um, the Family Star at Thrill Ride. Um, it's a bit like a spinning wild mouse. Um, that's what it is. I thought it was average. Um, I would have liked for the cars to have spun more. Um, but it's a nice layout and you can get some nice views and a nice lift up to the uh, to the top um, I wasn't overly excited but it it was okay and <laughs> um, the log flume I, um, I did enjoy and um, I would have liked it uh, to have had more theme, uh, theming though um, I did get wet and it was a fun ride. Um, lightning, the Lightning 3D uh, thrill ride. Oh, sorry, the Lightning 360 is a fan, I thought was a fantastic thrill ride at planes that can, that can turn 360 degrees right or left. Um, you're lifted up. Um, on like a tower and you can turn as many times as you like um, you can 
a turn upside down if you want to or if you don't want to turn upside down then you don't have to um, and uh, because you can control the ride so if you just wanted to just go up and just spin around as as usual then you can do that and if you wanted to spin um, as many times left and right as you can you can do that as well which is uh, fantastic it, it's a great in my opinion do it you, uh, do it yourself right and um, again if you want it to be do it yourself um, uh, the gallopers um, I really enjoyed this uh, retro family ride um, I've loved these uh, carousels um, ever since I was a child and the haunted hotel was a great ghost, uh, ghost, ghost train family ride which um, had some special effects as well so I really enjoyed that. The pirate ship is another fantastic retro ride that I really enjoyed and um, Skydrop um, is a fantastic tower drop ride. A bit like um, Apocalypse um, at Drayton Manor, even though Apocalypse is supposed to be closing. Um, but um, it is um, the seats are not um, spread around the pole, it's set out differently and uh, you do have to sit down as with apocalypse uh, you can stand up if you wanted to um but yes i really enjoyed the the sky drop um you can get some really good views uh, like with all the tower rides um really good feel ride for people that enjoy heights and um, moving on to the family snails ride and um, snails and fairy tales retro ride and um, it's a fantastic children and adults ride and um, i really enjoyed um the, the special effects and um, all the fairy tale nursery rhyme and cartoon characters and um, again it takes it, it just took me back um to when i was um, a child um, a, a lot of the time uh, like um there was an alice in wonderland part um of the ride uh, which again i re really enjoyed uh, from what I can remember and it's an indoor and outdoor ride and it's been at the beach since ever since 1966 how interesting is that and yes I mean if I think I might have gone on it at, um, as a child as well but I did definitely really enjoy it the time that I went on it and um, at um at great yarmouth at pleasure beach and um, moving on now to another traditional retro ride which is the wooden roller coaster called roller coaster and um, again really enjoyed that i had to have uh, two goes on that um, <laughs> um again it's a star attraction at uh, great yarmouth Pleasure Beach opened in 1932. Great design and um, also had some airtime. Really enjoyed it and um, very exciting. And uh, the Twister is um, a really good um, spinning retro ride as well. I've always enjoyed the Twister rides and um whirlwind and um, it's a fantastic um spinning roller a family spinning roller coaster ride um it 
it's uh, smaller than the fa a lot smaller than the family star but um to, uh, to me it ha did have that bit more um spin and i found it that more ex exciting re really than the family star oopsie daisy i'm gonna pick the paper the paper off um so yes re it really enjoyed it really recommend it um especially for people that say don't want the height of the family star but do like a good spin without going too high um um pendulum i didn't go on um for me it was a bit over the top um but if you like a really intense thrill ride then again it could be the ride for you um but it was just it just seemed too intense for me just looking at it so that's why i decided to give it a miss um and there was other exciting family rides like the monorail and um exciting yo-yo um yo-yo and the raft ride for uh, young children um so yes um it's a park in my opinion for all age groups um whether you're really young or um an adult so there's lots of different rides um, like children's fight rides family rides and field rides so to suit all age groups and lots of eating outlets and um, music playing as well which is nice and um, so i really enjoyed my ta uh, time now i thought it was worth the 15 pounds that i paid um for half a day so i would like to say thank you and bye for now and i'll see you tomorrow um for a souvenirs vlog so thank you and bye for now thank you bye